Hey what's going on guys this is Amir Hussain and you are watching Trick I Know YouTube channel In this video I am going to exactly show you how to set up the second hard drive caddy in case if you have a old laptop and you are looking to install a SSD on it or you maybe need the caddy if you need to add more storage to your laptop so basically I am going to show you which hard drive caddy you need what are the requirements and how to set it up step by step so without any further ado let's start the video So first of first guys let's see what is the second hard drive caddy second hard drive caddy is a enclosure to add a additional hard drive or ssd drive to your laptop by replacing the dvd writer of the laptop which is not useful these days to set it up i have a old dell laptop this is dell latitude 3440 with intel i3 4th generation processor and as it is a old laptop it have a dvd writer that means we can add more storage like 500 gb or 1 tb so in this video i am going to install a new ssd on this laptop by replacing the old hdd installed on it and by using the second hard drive caddy i will replace it with the dvd writer of the laptop to use it as a data storage drive Right now this is installed in this laptop here it is the C D and the E drive is the total 500 GB and here we have the extra DVD drive so guys let's start the video by installing the SSD drive to install the SSD first turn off the laptop then you will need a four head screw driver like this and maybe a pre tool like this just flip it up and remove the battery from it Now open the screw of the back cover using the four head screw driver then remove the back cover and here is our old 500 GB hard drive open the screws of hard drive and and slide out it using the pre tool our hdd is out guys now take out the ssd it's a crucial 240 gb ssd drive just plug it in the place of the old hdd the reason to put the ssd in the hdd place is we have to use it as a primary drive by installing operating system on it this is mandatory to install operating system into the ssd instead of the hdd otherwise you will not going to get benefit from the ssd speed so once the ssd is installed now get a bootable usb drive of any operating system you like plug the bootable usb to your laptop and complete the setup so here i installed the windows in this laptop after installing this laptop is performing much faster than before but as it is a old laptop now there is not any other slot to install the hdd we have only this c drive which is ssd and here is the dvd writer so now guys it's time to set up our caddy the installation of the caddy is so simple but if you go and check the caddy for your laptop offline or online you will see there are two types of caddy 12.7 mm and 9.5 mm now the question is which size of caddy is supported to your laptop to find it out first you have to open the dvd writer of your laptop but before make sure to remove the battery there is always one screw for the dvd writer just open it up and slide out the dvd writer using the pre tool or by your fingers so here is our dvd rom is out and take a plastic ruler which has the centimeter side also and bring the left side of the dvd writer towards you and using the ruler measure the width of the drive so as you can see here in scale it's showing about 9 mm width of this dvd rom that means you can purchase 9.5 mm second hard drive caddy for your laptop Now once you purchased a caddy for your laptop now you will need the front frame of the DVD writer take out a needle and insert it in the hole of the DVD drive and press it like this and it will manually eject the DVD drive now next flip it up and open the screw mounted in the panel sometimes there are two screws in my case here is one more hidden inside the frame Just open up all the screws then unmount the clips holding the frame here is the side clip and here is the base clip which is more bigger 
just unmount it carefully without breaking the frame so the front frame is out guys now next we have to do we have to unscrew the back mount of the drone just open up the screw and take out the mount like this now take out the 9.5 mm caddy and put the mount on the caddy in the dvd room and screw it up with the use of the screwdriver now insert the front frame to the front side of the caddy just like this just insert the big clip first and then the small clip here it's done guys now it's looking like our dvd writer now next slide in the hdd to the caddy like this take out the provided screws and tighten them in the back of the caddy so now our caddy is ready to plugged into the laptop just slide the caddy into the laptop just like this tight up the dvd rom screw plug the battery back into the laptop and here the caddy setup is end and we can use our laptop but there is one more thing we need to do and that is partition of the hdd just go to the this pc icon and open it up here you can see your ssd is showing and rest of the drives are from the hdd so as the hdd was the primary drive of this laptop and there was operating system installed on it that's why we are seeing a system reserve drive also here is the c drive and f drive is the d drive and the g drive is the e drive so first of first you have to make a backup of your hdd drive data i don't have any important data stored on it so i am going to format all the drives and going to make a fresh single data drive to do so right click on this pc icon and go to manage it will open the computer management now here you have to go to the disk management in the disk management here you can see it is showing two drives the disk 0 is the ssd drive and the disk 1 is the hdd drive so right click on all the partitions in the hdd and click on delete volume so system drive is deleted e drive is deleted deleted the f drive and here is the last one g drive in last you will find an unallocated space of 500 gigabytes just right click on it and click on new simple volume now press next next press next here also here also and click on finish now it will create a fresh single partition which will now called as a d drive here it is now it looks so organized here is the ssd drive and here is the data drive so guys we upgraded ssd in this laptop and also we added a storage drive using the hard drive caddy hope you enjoyed this video hope you find this video informative for more content like this consider subscribing this channel and also press the bell icon i will put the best caddy link and the ssd link in the description if you have any question regarding this let me know in the comment section thanks a lot for watching guys see you in my next video